The Empty Plate is a community non-profit pay-as-you-like cafe. We take all of the waste food from supermarkets, which is destined for landfill, bring it back here to the cafe and turn it into healthy and nutritious meals for the community to purchase on the, the pay-as-you-like principle. So they can either donate money or they can donate their time or uh, skills, anything they want, really. So almost a year now. I've been here a year. Since day one. So I have worked here from the very beginning. Six, seven months. Uh, only about a month actually. So just over a year. The challenges that we're facing at the moment are that when we first started there were very few organisations the same as us or doing similar kind of work. So the supermarkets had an awful lot of food to give away. Now more and more groups are springing up and the supermarkets are having to be accountable for their waste, the food is getting less. So we're having to source from a lot more places and be a bit more creative with where we're sourcing from to maintain the level of food that we're getting um, because the supermarkets just aren't, aren't giving as much these days. The community spirit. To see the pleasure that Mark can give people the jokes and the like fun that we have. So no two days are the same. It's the people who are working here and the people you're serving. Oh, the atmosphere, I think. And I like to think that I'm doing some good. The most rewarding part of the project so far has been knowing the, the people that we've helped and seeing the difference that it's made to them. Um, and we've had a couple of people that have literally been in tears because they had no way of getting any food and this was kind of their last chance saloon. So knowing that we're able to help those people, um, that's, yeah, that's the most rewarding part, I'd say. Have we got very long for the rest of this interview? <laughs> any of the homemade soups? Probably a roast out of all of them. So it's like a roasted red pepper tart. It's spaghetti bolognese? Let's say roast. I'd probably have to say roast dinner though. Oh, it's got to be steak and jacket potatoes. <laughs> the future plans for the empty plate are for us to get our own premises, because um, at the moment we rent this from uh, Worthing Homes. But we'd like to get our own premises where we can have the cafe running, but also enough room to open a pay-as-you-like shop, so that instead of the food sitting in our dry store for weeks and weeks on end until it's used that people can come along and buy it and actually use it and help people in more ways than we, we are at the moment. I'm extremely proud of Mark. When he sets his mind to something he puts heart and soul into it and this project he has put heart and soul into.